In healthy coronary arteries, the blood flows without obstruction. In diseased coronary arteries, a fatty substance called plaque forms in the artery walls, and as the disease advances, may bulge out into the path of the onrushing blood, blocking the oxygen and nutrients the heart desperately needs, and from time to time, causing symptoms like chest pains and shortness of breath. But heart attacks result more often from plaque that does not protrude into the artery itself, but remains hidden in the artery wall. One of the scariest things about coronary artery disease is that it can remain silent for so long. You can have plaque buildup in the coronary that isn't causing you any problem, doesn't cause you any symptoms, doesn't even cause a positive stress test, but suddenly ruptures. It ruptures, it causes a blood clot to form, the rest of the coronary artery, the rest of the pipe suddenly gets blocked and a heart attack occurs. And that's really the most common cause of heart attack. This is what kills people often in the primes of their lives. All plaque is dangerous, but some plaques are unstable, on the verge of rupture. Scientists are today trying to determine how to identify the unstable plaque, while doctors try and help patients minimize their risks.